Hi, my name is Natania Locke and I teach corporate governance in the AGSE. We teach corporate governance as part of the specialisation in the MBA Executive as well as in the Graduate Certificate of Corporate Governance. Today I'd like to share with you three key points about the role of technology and governance. The first point I'd like to share is that the use and usable storage of data in your organisation is already important but will be even more important in the future. As a governance professional, you are tasked with driving the strategic advantage that this data in your particular organisation presents. But more than that, data is already facilitating the governance task in your organisation. This brings me directly to my second point. As the reliability and quality of information in your organization improves, your duty of care and diligence as a governance professional will be enhanced. In future, governance professionals as well as board of directors will be able to access and verify data directly without the need to rely completely on the information provided to them by management. With this enhanced quality of information, comes an expectation of greater judgment and for that reason your duty of care and diligence will be enhanced. The last point I'd like to make is that although artificial intelligence and other technology in organisations will facilitate your task as a governance professional, you will need to have some understanding of this technology to enable you to use it appropriately. Without such an understanding, you run the risk of either over-relying on the technology or under-relying on it. If you over-rely on the technology, you will rely on it completely and not use any independent discretion. If you under-rely on it, you might ignore it to your own peril. We saw some examples of this recently with the failures of boards of directors and other governance professionals to act appropriately when breaches of anti-money laundering uh, legislation was flagged in their organisations. This implies that the skill set of governance professionals in the future will look different. To recap my three points, firstly, your use and curation of data in your organisation is important. Secondly, your duty of care and diligence is enhanced as your access to reliable and quality information improves. And thirdly, your skill set as a governance professional will look different in the future.